My last skill to impart on teachers using the new Power Teacher Pro gradebook is to the ability to copy assignments. And this is relatively new because we didn't used to be able to copy assignments from course to course or from grading period to grading period. Under the gear, there's now an option to copy assignments. Now, I'm on the score sheet page, so this gear uh, does change depending on what page you're on, but I'm on the score sheet page and I want to copy assignments. Notice here, uh, like I was saying, I can choose to copy from a certain term and class to perhaps the same uh, class but a different term. So if I were teaching a, or a semester based class and I knew I was going to use the similar assessment model, uh, same number of journals, or I was going to put all of my uh, major unit assessments from my uh, semester one into my semester two, I can quickly choose, uh, for example, my uh, Math Tech 4, which we just added a couple assignments into. I can copy everything from quarter 4, and I can drop that back into perhaps quarter 1. One of the interesting features to Power Teacher Pro is that you can also set up due dates that are relational. So in this situation where I'm copying from one quarter to another, what Power Teacher Pro is going to calculate is that if I have um, journals due at the end of every week, for example, it's going to just shift those due dates in that quarter. So all of my journals from quarter one are going to have um, be spread out across quarter four, or quarter two, whatever I'm copying to. Now, I'm not seeing any assignments to be copied. I don't have enough in here, uh, but suffice it to say, as I uh, make choices about what quarter and what course, I'll have the option to click through the assignments that I want to copy, and it will then copy just those things that I want to copy. So we're not encouraging folks to copy their entire gradebook from uh, last year to next year. Um, of course, you'll make a lot of decisions about how to improve your teaching and assessment practices. So this isn't about just rolling over from year to year, quarter to quarter. But if there are things that you do know specifically that you will use uh, each grading period or even between two different course titles, you'll have a lot of flexibility to choose, uh, pick and choose those assignments and then copy them. That's about it for the Power Teacher Gradebook um, score sheet and the assignments area. In our next video, we're going to take a look at how to use some of the analytics that Power Teacher Pro lends us.